It's Tuesday, February 19th, 2019, and this is, these are your great morning announcements. My name is Joey. I'm Cole. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Lunch for today will be whole grain pizza taco, green beans, peaches, pretzel stick, and milk. For Wednesday, hamburger. Thursday will be whole grain chicken chunks. And on Friday, it will be taco turkey. Fantastic! Let's go over to Musa with a fan with a check on our what on the weather. Good morning. The weather up. For today, it will be cloudy with a high of 35 degrees. I predict a 30, 89% chance of outdoor recess. For Wednesday, we will see a warmer temperature with a high of 38 degrees. 38 degrees? And the chance for snow by Thursday, where we will be back to cloudy skies. And on Friday, we may even see the sun as the temperatures heat up to 43 degrees? What? As always, be sure to dress for the weather and make it a wonderful weather day. Now, let's go over to Ryan with our incredible information segment. Good morning. We are halfway through Black History Month, and today I want to talk about an amazing man named Robert Smalls. He was born into slavery, and when he was young, he worked in the shipyards and gave him his paycheck to his master. When the Civil War started, he became a Navy seaman for South, who was pro-slavery, then he did the unthinkable. He took over the ship, sailed it straight to the north, and handed it over to them. In fact, he worked for the north for the war. In fact, he was he went to on to captain his own ship. But his amazing story doesn't stop there. After the war, he learned how to read, but, and he also refused to give up his seat to a white person on a streetcar in Pennsylvania. He ended up going to politics, and he served on South California legislature. He was elected the, to the House of Representatives in 1874. Then. He went back to his plantation where he had bought went, had been a slave and he bought it. He lived there until his death in 1915. As always, you can learn more about Black History Month in your grant library. Back to you, Lincoln. Now it's time for a spin the wheel segment. That's right, where we get to find out exactly what our activity will be for Wellness Wednesday. Let's do it. And in the Wellness Wednesday, and the Wellness Wednesday activity will be brought to you by Mrs. Williams' class. Yay! 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 Look for an email from Mrs. Mazgrod with specific directions. Now for a joke to end our newscast. What? Why? What, what do you call an elephant in a closet? Why is there an elephant in your closet? Oh, never mind. What do you call an elephant in your closet? Stop. Joey and Cole and Musa and Ryan signing off. The new